By simply placing your pointer anywhere over the UCS icon and right clicking, we can now rapidly get to a useful shortcut menu here that allows us to do a variety of things with our UCS system, and we'll be covering these in more detail in upcoming segments. Now the first is obviously a very quick shortcut that goes back to the world UCS, and another one that allows you to go back to the previous UCS. So it's kind of like an undo control almost that's specific to the UCS. We'll then be able to create and name our own UCS systems and select between those and then perform UCS modification by moving or relocating the origin point, defining the coordinate axes, either using three point axes rotation or the Z axis normal control. We'll then be able to do an orthogonal UCS that allows us to place annotative components view, and we'll be able to intelligently tumble around the object and align the UCS to the geometry using face and object controls. Finally, we'll be able to control the appearance of the UCS icon here. So in the next few segments, we'll take these things apart one by one and see how they actually work.